Vietnam Tech Guru here with hot new game Outbreak in Space VR, which you'd think they would put somewhere here on the title screen, but no. Uh, this is the second day in a row I've played an unusual game of Breakout. Okay, this is cute. Uh, yesterday was one in a fantasy setting where you... Whoa! That's not easy. Apparently, Arkanoid a lot harder when you have to hit it yourself. Also, I'm just going to say uh, part of it is that the ball is going ridiculously fast. Like, they might have wanted to put a speed limiter on this ball, because once you accidentally get it going at all, there's no way to slow it back down, is there? Oh, I see. Bigger shield, smaller field. Bigger ball, smaller ball. Wow. Okay, extra life, split ball, split ball, faster ball, slower ball. Yeah, there's gotta be a way. YouTube press start to begin. Apparently, I'm the 10th best in the world? That can't be right. Yeah. All right, let's see what a 3D level is like. I had you! I swear I had that. Where is it? Sorry. Whoops. Apparently I hadn't actually gone out yet. I just thought I had. Or maybe I had and I immediately... Whoa! I uh, knocked it backwards. And that is laser shield. Which I didn't get to use at all. This is going quite badly. I see the appeal, but uh, part of it is laser shield, please. Alright, here we go. Do I get to keep the laser shield for the whole level, or, or no? Is it a time thing? Slow it down, buddy. No, multi ball! Luckily, I'm not worried, because, you know. What? You saw it go right through the panel there, right? What is happening? Hey, fourth place. That's considerably better. Seriously, though, why was that going straight through the shield? I don't understand at all what happened there. I am sure, yes. All right, let's see. 360 level. How do you go out in this level? Like, I honestly don't know how you go out in this level. Show invisible? There are invisible things? So is it, oh, wait, is this the whole concept of this level just to see how long it takes you to win? Not that it has any penalty? Or is it if it hits the top, you lose? I have no idea what's happening anymore. I love it, but I have no idea what's happening. There we go. Yeah. Whatever's happening, I don't feel like I'm a part of it anymore. Wait, how did I die? Is it if you hit this square on the floor? Is that it? Because if that's it, just tell me. Whoa. And then 17 balls attacked. I just, I don't want to get in the way of this. Bigger, laser. Come on, we can do this, everybody. If I get the middle one, they all go at once. Okay, 
Okay, don't touch the axe, because you immediately lose a life. Plus one, I assume, is an extra life. Yeah, okay. Mission accomplished? Hell yes! I'm still super nervous about this. No! I lost the ball! What the hell? Okay, then I just lost a life by touching something I didn't mean to. Yeah, they've gotta let it make it a little more difficult for you to touch the, uh... Uh... You have to be able to be more selective about what bonus you want to touch is a complaint I'm making now. Yes! Laser! Faster, faster. No, I'm not touching you guys. Nope. This, um, yeah. Is it weird that I'm doing, like, way better at the extreme difficulty than I did at any previous version of this? I would like that free man, please. And this free man. And that free man. And boom! Okay! Oh no, my score's ever declining. Whatever shall I do? Continue playing the game? Okay. What is happening? Gah! Wait, where did you hit? It's hard not to flinch, is what I'm saying. So I lose two or three points per second. And I have a hundred thousand whoa uh points so that should keep me going for a while yeah that was probably a mistake I, I have no idea what's happening anymore yeah once it reaches a certain speed you just are a spectator what does that do exploding ball Whoa! Then I immediately died before I got a chance to get any of that sweet treasure. Nope. Yeah, I'm really bad at this, huh? Okay, here we go. We got this. Nope. Screwed that up pretty badly. I guess this is the level that breaks me. Ugh. Although, I, in my defense, it is really hard to angle things in this level. Yay! Multi-ball! Larger attack things. Wait, I just realized something. I think I know why the... Yeah, it turned red because I stepped out. If you step out of this box, uh, then your shield doesn't work, right? Oh, I should probably try to swing back here, too. No? Okay. Oh, come on! Like, if my headset what cord wasn't tangled already... What? Could some of you do something? How can I have eight balls going simultaneously and nothing is happening? Okay, they did get a couple. But only a couple. I think this is a weird situation where having... If you think about the volume of this space, right? So, you think about a game of Breakout, right? And in that game of Breakout, the ball takes up a you know, uh, amount of space, while not, like, strictly commensurate to a significant part of... Is that it? Are we done? We're done. Okay. That sucked. Uh, so the ball takes up an amount of space equivalent to a tiny portion of the amount of space in the entire map, right? But it is, and this is the key part, it is a recognizable portion of the map. Alright, so it is, let's say, one two-thousandth of the map. 
is the amount of space the ball takes up. And as the ball travels around, you know, zooms around, taking up 1, 2,000. And so, just statistically speaking, uh, you're bound to hit something eventually, is what I'm saying. Because it's only 1, 2,000th, and it's constantly moving. So just, you know, law of averages, without any strategy, just hitting the ball over and over again, you're eventually going to get everything, right? Whereas this, when you expand it out to three dimensions, the amount of space the ball takes up compared to, god damn it, the amount, number, the amount of space the bricks take up is infinitesimally small. So you can have, in a regular game of breakout, you, if you had eight balls bouncing around the screen simultaneously, there's no way to uh, keep those from being successful, right? You would, you would wrap it up in seconds. Whereas in this thing, you can have eight balls banging around the place simultaneously, and, and I'm not being figuratively here, only have an okay chance of hitting maybe one or two bricks. Game over. Oh, people are much, oh wow, I'm number two. Where'd he go? I thought I was gonna say people were much better than me because I was way down there, but I was actually number four. Uh, it looks like I'm number four, I'm actually number two, so way to go. So weirdly, like, the highest scoring one, the easiest one, is the one they call extreme difficulty. That's strange, right? Anyway, this is Breakout in 3D. I mean, I'm finding it intriguing even as I'm finding it incredibly frustrating. Which makes this a perfect time for me to sign off. I have been the hidden object guru. What the hell? Oh, right, the automatic thing. Why did they all, like, I understand. What just happened? Like, I have no idea. I mean, I know why they all stopped hitting me, right? Also, if I'm outside, see, I understand why it doesn't work there, right? But sometimes it goes through with when I swear it's inside. And my thing turns red as it hits it. I'm like, does the laser shot not allow me to reflect? That wouldn't make sense. No, I can reflect with the laser. Apparently the lasers can't just fire in two dimensions. Come on. Whew! Really, you don't want to give me like a moment's grace before you restart that nonsense? I guess not. Okay, as I was saying, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons coming up for that. Questions, suggestions, game recommendations. Uh, yes, even video requests can be put into the comment section below the video. And I will see what I can do. Uh, <laughs> and if you'd like to see more, there's buttons. Did I say that already? The game has got me all khaki wampus. Come on, let's do this. You can do it. Yes! Uh, wow, I certainly aimed that that poorly. Ugh. Khaki wampus. Nope. Kaboom! I will see you back here for more new and upcoming games. Uh, but until then, au revoir.